The Department of Environment and Conservation DEC, was a department of the Government of Western Australia that was responsible for implementing the state's conservation and environment legislation and regulations. It was formed on 1 July 2006 by the amalgamation of the Department of Environment and the Department of Conservation and Land Management. The DEC was separated on 30 June 2013 forming the Department of Parks and Wildlife DPAW, and the Department of Environment Regulation DER, which both commenced operations on 1 July 2013. DPAW focuses on nature conservation and the community's enjoyment and appreciation of Western Australia's world-class network of national and marine parks. DER focuses on environmental regulation, approvals and appeals processes, and pollution prevention. Topic. Status at dissolution, the 30th of June 2013. The department was managing more than 285,000 square kilometers, including more than 9% of WAS land area, its national parks, marine parks, conservation parks, regional parks, state forests and timber reserves, nature reserves, roadside reserves and marine nature reserves. It provided visitor and recreation facilities at a sustainable level for many of these. It also supported or worked closely with the following authorities Environmental Protection Authority, Conservation Commission of WA, Keep Australia Beautiful, Marine Parks and Reserves Authority, Swan River Trust. Waste Authority Total Reportable Visitation to Deck Managed Lands and Waters during the 2012-13 financial year was 16.02 million, with visitor satisfaction levels of 88%. 4,717 people were registered volunteers with the department in 2012-13 that helped in a range of projects across the state with 564,350 hours contributed. DEC was responsible from 2007 to 2013 for protecting and conserving the state of Western Australia's environment. This included managing state forests, 1,304,442 hectares. 99 national parks, 6,246,692 hectares. 16 conservation parks 847,578 hectares 13 marine parks 2,206,612 hectares 1 marine nature reserve 132,000 hectares nature reserves 10,244,167 hectares at the 30th of June 2013 the total area under department of environment and conservation's care was 28,531,987 hectares the department's key responsibilities also included roles in managing, regulating and assessing aspects of the use of the state's natural resources and biodiversity, including the regulation of native vegetation clearing and pollution control. The department initiated 14 environmental prosecutions during 2012-13, involving a broad range of charges including pollution, unauthorized clearing of native vegetation and illegal dumping. At 30 June 2013, eight environmental prosecutions remained before the courts. 
there were an additional 18 pending cases that, subject to the evidentiary standard being met, could result in prosecution or other sanction. DEC was also responsible for the wildlife conservation project Western Shield. The department was also in charge of wildfire prevention and suppression on its land as well as fire prevention in unallocated Crown land. The indicative burn target for 2012–13 in the southwest forest regions was 200,000 hectares. In 2012–13, DEC achieved 23,468 hectares in the southwest forest regions, including about 6,410 hectares that were burnt for pine plantation protection. The combination of unsuitable weather conditions, fuels remaining dry due to summer conditions extending into autumn, and enhanced requirements in prescribed burn planning and risk management as a result of the 2011 Margaret River bushfire contributed to a significant reduction of the area able to be prescribed burnt this year. The average area of burning achieved over the past 10 years has been about 163,019 hectares per annum. A further 6,023,884 hectares was burnt in the Kimberley, Pilbara, Goldfields, Midwest, Wheatbelt and South Coast regions. The burns were carried out on deck managed lands as well as on unallocated crown lands and unmanaged reserves within these regions. Deck staff attended and monitored 676 bushfires throughout the state in 2012-13, which burnt about 5,477,394 hectares. The causes of these fires were lightning 28% above the 10 year average of about 24% deliberately lit or arson caused fires 37% below the 10 year average of about 43% accidental fires 16% escapes from private burns 4% Escapes from deck burns 0% Other causes 4% Unknown 11% Some of the most severe bushfires the department had to suppress, in chronological order, included Topic Preceding agencies National parks and the earlier forms in Western Australia were under Department of Lands and Surveys, 1 January 1890 partly split, 31 December 1895 Wood and Forests Department, the 1st of January 1896 to the 31st of December 1918. Forests Department, the 1st of January 1919 to the 21st of March 1985. State Gardens Board, the 15th of December 1920 to the 30th of April 1957, Parks and Reserves Act 1895. National Parks Board, the 1st of May 1957 to the 30th of July 1977. Department of Fisheries and Fauna, the 1st of October 1964 to the 31st of December 1973. National Parks Authority, the 1st of August 1977 to the 15th of April 1985. National Parks Authority Act 1976. Wildlife Section of the Department of Fisheries and Wildlife, the 1st of January 1974 to the 21st of March 1985. 
Department of Environment, the 1st of July 2004 to the 30th of June 2006. Department of Conservation and Land Management, the 22nd of March 1985 to the 30th of June 2006. Conservation and Land Management Act 1984. Topic: Vehicles. The department maintained and coordinated a range of specialist equipment and emergency response vehicles. This included pumpers, water bombers and tankers and other equipment relating to operations involving search and rescue and firefighting. Topic: See also National Parks of Western Australia Australasian Fire and Emergency Service Authorities Council Topic Notes Topic External Links Department of Environment and Conservation Department of Parks and Wildlife Western Australia Department of Environment Regulation